just came forward here to catch that rainbow. I'm not sure if you can see it. Just starting to rain a little bit. So we've traveled about 80 miles through the Gulf Stream and we're hoping to pop out on the other side and have uh, a different weather pattern to deal with going the rest of the way to Bermuda. Uh, I think we've traveled probably 250, 300 miles so far which is probably like the halfway point. And uh, the water is just so incredibly blue, a deep still very windy. We've had a gale the, just about the whole time, although the gale's subsided. It's just white caps today. As you can see the boat going forward here. And uh, we still have our same, same watches, 8 a.m. to noon and 8 p.m. to midnight. I'm out here on the on the deck. And then when you're not on, when you're not working, when you're not on watch. Because it's very, it's very tiring up here. It's uh, you got to really hold on to the to the boat at all times. You got to be strapped in at all times, and it's, uh, it's it's kind of exhausting. And so you really need your sleep, and you really you conk right out as soon as you hit that bump. We got a big set of waves coming in here from the north. It might be a uh, northeast. Oh, I'm gonna get me. You can feel the heat radiating off the water. The air is cold, but it's like there's a hair dryer blowing air up off the water. by that flag up there that we're running with the wind, the wind's pushing the boat. It's been pushing the boat the whole time and we've been under one sail the whole time here. It's a pretty good way. 